has such a rich architectural history. Hi, I'm Cassie and this is Josh and this is our little boy Harley and for the past five years we've been living in Brisbane, Australia and probably for most of that time we've been craving something more craving the open road and the great outdoors so after years of dreaming we decided to buy a caravan and go and explore our own backyard this is our story subscribe and tune in every week to see what we get up to Hello everyone, welcome to Launceston, Tasmania. You might be wondering where our beautiful caravan is if you've been following along the journey so far. But if you are new around here, my name's Cassie and my partner Josh and I bought a 1976 Franklin Arrow caravan at the start of the year with the intention of renovating it and traveling Australia. Now we definitely got up to a bit of a bumpy start, but our caravan is currently in Mackay waiting for the finishing touches and Josh picked up a work contract down here in Launceston. If you don't know where it is, it's the island state right down the bottom of Australia. We're here for three incredible weeks and we can't wait to show you the beautiful city of Launceston. First settled in 1804, Launceston is Tasmania's second largest city and gateway to the northern and eastern regions. The first people of Launceston were the Latera Marana people. Their country encompasses most of the Tamar Valley region and can be dated from at least 7,000 years ago. Unlike Australia's mainland states, the city of Launceston enjoys four true seasons and we definitely experience the majority of them while here. It's so funny because internally I'm like boiling <laughs> and getting quite puffed but then this wind chill just hits you and all your extremities are cold. <laughs> and I just want to show you how most places in Tasmania outside of the actual suburb or township it's just beautiful natural landscape. Check it out. Currently walking the streets of rainy Launceston, taking in all the architecture. We just had a beautiful breakfast at Earthy Eats, which also has avocado moon kombucha made there. And yeah, now we're just walking past the Queen Victoria Art Gallery, which hopefully we'll get to check out while we're here. Can we do that? You want to cross? Yep. Quick, before we die! <laughs> I actually love this rainy weather. Yeah. It makes me feel like we're in England. Tasmania definitely is the, one of the most English like weather type and landscape looking of all I think the Australian states. One of the things I love about Tasmania and Launceston in particular is there's such a rich architectural history. You've got art deco next to federation style homes, colonial-esque style buildings next to modern ones and you'll see how old buildings have been repurposed in a beautiful way uh, to keep using them for generations to come to be able to preserve the architecture and 
if you have nothing to do when you come to Launceston, which will be hard because there's so many amazing things to see and do, but just take a stroll around the neighbourhoods and, and have a look at the old buildings. It's really cool to see. guys please subscribe so you don't miss out on all the future episodes and i'll see you next time